This post walks you through a typical mechanical PE exam question in the category of HVAC equipment and specifically on cooling towers. So first, the problem. A cooling tower is used to cool 95 degrees Fahrenheit condenser water down to 85 degrees. If the design width bulb is 78 degrees, then what is the approach and range? Is it A, range equals 10, approach equals 10, B, range equals 7, approach equals 10, C, range equals 10, approach equals 7, or D, range equals 17, approach equals 7? professional engineer must be able to properly design and size and select a cooling tower to fit the HVAC application. Cooling towers are characterized by two terms, the approach and the range. The range of the cooling tower is the difference between the entering and exiting temperature of the cooling tower water. The approach, or approach to wet bulb, is the temperature difference between the water out and the wet bulb temperature of the air. The approach is important because it describes the level of performance of the cooling tower. The smaller the approach, the better the cooling tower is at providing cooling. The wet bulb temperature of the entering air is the lowest the temperature of the exiting water can reach. If a cooling tower has a zero degree approach, then the cooling tower is using all of the available heat exchange from the air to cool the water. So let's solve our problem by plugging in the values to the equations. For range, we get 95 minus 85 equals 10 degrees Fahrenheit. For approach, we get 85 minus 78 as the wet bulb to equal 7 degrees Fahrenheit. So our correct answer is C, range equals 10, approach equals 7. For more information and more practice problems, please refer to the links below. Thank you.